I'm joining you from my home in Kespawik, in Mi'kma'ki, the traditional unceded territory of the Mi'kmaq people. Every day our Canadian Coast Guard members work hard to protect our waters and the people who make their living on the sea. More often than not, this work takes place in remote and challenging conditions. Helicopters and pilots who fly them are vital to this work. Not only do they move people and cargo between ship and shore, they also provide important support for icebreaking activities, and they help with search and rescue as well. Our helicopters are used for ice surveillance and aids to navigation. They can also support the Coast Guard's environmental response program, as well as scientific research and fisheries enforcement. With so many duties entrusted to the Coast Guard, our pilots need state-of-the-art equipment for training to do their jobs safely and efficiently. Today, under the government's fleet renewal plan, I am very pleased to welcome the delivery of a new full-flight helicopter simulator that will allow helicopter pilots to train for challenging and high-risk situations that would otherwise be too dangerous in a real aircraft without ever having to leave the ground. Designed and built in Canada, this simulator is equipped with leading-edge technology systems that allow the pilots to train in highly immersive and realistic environments. In 2012, the government launched a large-scale procurement effort to replace the Coast Guard's aging fleet with 15 Bell 429 light-lift helicopters and 7 Bell 412 EPI medium-lift helicopters. Today, the Coast Guard is proud to have 22 new helicopters in its fleet, each of which is outfitted with state-of-the-art avionics and automation. With the addition of the first full-flight helicopter simulator of its kind in Canada and in the world, pilots will be safely trained at the Transport Canada Training Centre in Ottawa International Airport. This is a proud moment in our company's history as the Canadian Coast Guard will now be trained on the CAE simulator. And not just any simulator. The CAE 3000 series helicopter simulator is the most advanced helicopter simulator ever developed and has earned the highest qualification with Transport Canada. It features CAE revolutionary roll-on, roll-off design, which enables the B-412 and the B-429 Level D cockpits to operate in a mothership with full motion and an ultra-high resolution 12-foot dome visual system. These helicopters are wildly used by the Canadian Coast Guard for maritime security and other fisheries activities. And again, we couldn't be more proud to serve them. What also makes this simulator so special is that the CAE 3000 series allows crews to conduct training in highly realistic virtual helicopter simulations in a safe environment. The unique and advanced helicopter flight simulator will play a key role in ensuring the Coast Guard crews who fly very demanding missions in some of the harshest conditions are trained and well prepared for the worst real life scenarios. Therefore, keeping those who protect us from harm safe. Although we cannot celebrate this milestone in person at the Transport Canada's training center in Ottawa, I'm taking this virtual moment to sincerely thank the CAE team who worked in close collaboration with the Canadian Coast Guard to deliver this project. We are proud to work with a client whose mission and values are aligned with ours to protect lives and make the world a safer place. This collaboration helps us maintain our long-standing relationship with the Canadian government, which is of utter importance to us. I would also like to thank the Government of Canada and the Coast Guard for trusting us to be your training partner of choice. Thank you, Faust. Today is a very important milestone for the Canadian Coast Guard as we accept our full flight simulator for our helicopters. With Coast Guard specific mission scenarios, our pilots will now be able to practice difficult operation in a safe environment. The new simulator will allow our pilot to practice scenarios such as bringing equipment to mountain tops, landing on Coast Guard ships, or just supporting search and rescue. Over my career at the Canadian Coast Guard, I had the privilege to, to see evolving technology that not only make our operations safer, uh, but also improve our efficiencies. This simulator is uh, pushing the boundaries of the Canadian and modern technology. I would like to congratulate every employee of CAE who have contributed to the construction of this unique simulator in Canada and across the world. I am personally excited to see how this new simulator will contribute to improve the training and uh, the overall safety of our operations. 
My name is Dave Weir. I'm the Deputy Director of Flight Operations here at Transport Canada. Along with the team here at Transport and their partners at Coast Guard, uh, we run the Coast Guard helicopter operation. I have very, very, very little simulator time in my career. I've been flying helicopters for about 30 years. Over those 30 years, all the training that I've done and all the experience that I have have been on real aircraft. Uh, so the first time in the simulator was a, a real experience for me. It was amazing. It gives me that feeling that I get in my stomach when I'm actually flying. Oh, this is great. Look at that. What I was not expecting was how the situations that they put me in uh, for some emergencies and some bad weather situations actually physically made me feel uncomfortable. Um, whereas I figured it was just going to be kind of like playing a video game, it absolutely wasn't. It was like being in the aircraft, in the environment. It was, it was astonishing. And there was one scenario where we were on a ship and we reduced the weather to very poor weather. And, um, you know, it was the type of thing where I might just reject that flight. And then realizing that I'm actually in a simulator, I can go and take that risk without any real consequence. Being able to introduce people to levels of emergencies that you wouldn't be able to do in the real aircraft just because of the risk involved with them just puts us in a position where we're going to be able to have our pilots experience and have a tool bag of things that otherwise they just wouldn't really be able to train for ever. On behalf of the Government of Canada, I want to congratulate CAE employees for their dedicated work in the design and construction of this breakthrough simulator. I also wish all of our pilots much success with their training on this simulator. What impresses me the most about this simulator is that it features CAE's roll-on, roll-off cockpit design. This simulator is uh, pushing the boundaries of the Canadian and modern technology. Be able to experience real mechanical failures that you just can't simulate in the real aircraft. Its ability to deliver a fully immersive training experience is so close to the real thing. 